Hey guys, Ranger here, and welcome back to another very, very special video. I have with me something that I have been wanting for at least two, maybe three years. And that is what I have with me here. I found out about it two, three years ago. I didn't even know that it existed. And I wanted to get one, but I couldn't because... It was hard to track down, and it was expensive, and I just kept trying. I didn't want to give up. I, I knew that I wanted to get it, and I wasn't going to give up until I did. And finally, thank God, a couple weeks ago, I found one for a good price. And I have with me, right, something that I've been wanting for so long. Fallout Equestria, the book. The print-off? I mean, the, the Fallout Equestria, the book. And I have it right here. And it, it's just shocking that I actually got it, but let's go ahead and begin. Oh, my gosh. Fallout Equestria. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. This is the third edition print of Fallout Equestria. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. Oh my gosh. Fallout Equestria. Oh my gosh. This is it. I don't believe it years of wanting this book. There's a recipe in here for chocolate chip cookies. Oh my gosh. Fallout Equestria by K-Cat. <laughs> this is it! This is it! Third edition. March 2017. Per the author's request, the story remains in its original unedited format. Here's all the chapters. Introduction. Equestrian Wasteland. This is it. This is the book. And I believe, according to this, uh, I'm being very, very gentle, gentle with this. Chapter 20.5 is also in this book. Yep, a mare worth fighting for. It's here. I'm being trying to be very, very gentle. There's the beginning. The introduction. Volume 1. This, oh my gosh, there's the pit buck. And it's got the illustrations. All the illustrations are there. I don't believe it. I don't believe it. I don't believe it! After two years! I finally got it! Oh my gosh. I got this in the mail um, three days ago and I haven't opened it because I wanted to wait until I had a day off. And I wanted to wait until I had a day off before I opened it. This is it! The third edition! And whenever I got it in the mail, I literally, I, I turned into Rainbow Dash. As soon as I got it in the mail, I opened, I mean, I mean as soon as I got it in the mail, I, I literally turned into Rainbow Dash. I started, uh, I, I held the package in my hand, and I was literally, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I've wanted this for at least two years. And I've seen a couple of different prints, but... First one I think sold for eight hundred dollars. Another one sold for a thousand, and I got this one for two hundred and forty-five. And I just, I, I'm holding it, and I, I just don't believe it. You know, like it feels surreal. Fallout Equestria is one of my most. Fallout Equestria is one of my most favorite fan fictions of all time and 
as soon as I found, I mean, I found out, like, two, three years ago, I didn't even know they made a printed version, a book version, and I didn't even know they did, and then I found out that they did, and I'm, and I knew I, I, I knew I wanted to get it, but I didn't know when I'd be able to. I, I thought, like, I, I'm never going to be worthy enough to get it. And I hold it in my hand. <laughs> it's so beautiful. It's so beautiful. Just, I don't believe it. Like, I hold it in my hand. But let it question you. The whole thing. Including a mare worth fighting for. I just, yeah. I don't believe it. I don't believe it. And I love the art. I love the art on the front. That's beautiful. And I love how they have the illustrations. And, you know, it's not just a story that you read. I mean, there's actual illustrations inside of it, too. But this is the unedited. I mean, oh, my gosh. Oh my gosh. I don't believe it. I got it. <laughs> I got the book of Equestria! I got the book of Equestria! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. But, yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is so beautiful. This is so gorgeous. I'm keeping this in this here so that it won't get... I'm keeping it in this box so that it won't get damaged, it won't get scratched or bent, skint, anything. In this box. I'm keeping it in this box so that it won't get scratched or bent or skint. Because this is special to me. This is, this is special to me. I'm keeping it in this box so that it won't get damaged, it won't get scratched or... I just... I've got, I've got Fallout Equestria, I've got Fallout Equestria, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, I don't believe it, oh. I've got Fallout Equestria, I, I, I got the third edition, the printed in March last year, oh my gosh, like, oh my gosh, oh man, oh my gosh. I never, I, I always, I wanted the book, is, I mean, like, from the moment that I found out that they made a, that they made a full printed book, I knew I wanted it, but I never knew whenever I'd be able to get one. I figured it'd be after MLP was over, you know? But, here it is. It's April, um, 19th. And I got Oh my gosh. Oh, the third edition Fallen Equestria, and it's so gorgeous. It's so beautiful. Oh my gosh. I just, I, again, I, I just can't believe I actually got it, you know? But this is, this is one of my, this is one of my most favorite fan fictions of all time. This and Project Horizons. Favorite, two favorite fan fictions of all time. And I just, I, <laughs> I just don't believe it, you know? I don't believe it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my god, Fall out Equestria. I got Fall out Equestria! <laughs> oh my gosh. But, uh, I, I'm keeping this in this box so it won't get damaged. I'm, I'm going to do everything I can to preserve this. Because this thing is amazing. This story is amazing. And... So I'm doing what I can to preserve this because this is my one of my most favorite fan fictions of all time. This and Project Horizons. I, I really want to say to uh, everybody that has put forth effort into printing off these books, thank you all so much. Thank you. And it, it'd be great if they made a, if they could make like a fourth version as well, like a fourth edition, and continue to print it, but. I don't, I can't believe I actually got it, but, again, I want to thank KCAT for creating Fallout Equestria, for creating such an amazing sub-fandom within the fandom, um, 
thank you to KCAT for writing Fallout Equestria and to Somber for doing Fallout Equestria Project Horizons as well and to everybody that has penned, that has written a Fallout Equestria fanfic or done Fallout Equestria fan art, thank you all so much. Um, I love this, I love the Fallout Equestria fandom and I would not, I would not have started, I would not have started playing Fallout, the Fallout games themselves. I would not have even delved into the games if it wasn't for this story. And so, thank you to KCAT and to Somber for getting me involved with the Fallout video game series. And now I love it to death. It's one of my favorite game game franchises of all time. And so thank you to KCAT, thank you to Somber, and thank you to everybody who's done something for Fallout Equestria, with Fallout Equestria. And thank you as well to everybody that has printed these books. Thank you to everybody. It is, it is such an honor to have this book. It is such an honor, and this I, I cherish this thing right now. This is so special to me. So thank you to everybody, and uh, I will not apologize for my geek out because. <coughs> but again, thank you guys again for joining me, and I hope you got some laughs. Um, but thank you again for joining me, and hopefully I'll see you guys in the next video that I do. Take care.